In this video, we will discuss the prep for FCP underscore FGT underscore AD 7.6 FCP. Fortigate 7.6 Administrator Exam. 4 Tips for Your Preparation 1. Create a Study Plan 2. Understand the Exam Blueprint 3. Take Online Training 4. Practice with Sample Questions What is FCP? Fortigate 7.6 Administrator Understand the exam blueprint. Topic 1. Deployment and System Configuration Topic 2. Firewall Policies and Authentication Topic 3. Content Inspection Topic 4. Routing and VPN Practice online FCP underscore FGT underscore AD 7.6 free questions from CERT 007. 1. Which two actions are required to include a 4D switch in the security fabric? A. Enable Fortilink on FortiGate. B. Enable SNMP on 4D switch. C. Authorize the switch on FortiGate. D. Configure DHCP on 4D switch. 2. In a FortiGate HA active passive cluster, which configuration setting must be identical across all units? A. Host name. B. Management IP. C. HA mode. D. Device priority. 3. What is the evaluation order of firewall policies on a FortiGate device? A. Most specific to least specific. B. Random. C. Lowest to highest policy ID. D. Top to bottom as listed in the GUI. 4. What is required to enable Fortinet single sign-on, FSSO, in a FortiGate environment? A. Radius Server Configuration B. LDAP Object Group C. Collector Agent on a Domain Controller D. Kerberos Authentication 5. What happens when two static routes have the same destination and distance but different priorities? A. Both are used for load balancing. B. The one with higher priority is preferred. C. The route with the lower metric is chosen. D. Fortigate will randomly select between them. 6. What feature allows Fortigate to select the best performing WAN link in an SD-WAN configuration? A. Link health monitoring. B. Distance metric. C. Routing policy. D. Next hop verification. 7. What is a key difference between SSL VPN tunnel mode and web mode? A. Web mode supports all traffic types. B. Tunnel mode requires a browser plugin. C. Web mode allows access to internal web apps via a browser. D. Tunnel mode is limited to HTTP traffic. 8. Which antivirus scanning mode provides the most comprehensive protection but may introduce latency? A. Flow-based 
B. Proxy based. C. Inline scanning. D. Heuristic only mode. 9. When creating a static route, what must be specified to ensure proper packet forwarding? A. Interface and gateway IP. B. Administrative distance only. C. Destination MAC address. D. DNS server. 10. Which two items must be configured to successfully deploy an SSL VPN in tunnel mode? A. IP pool. B. Policy route. C. SSL VPN portal. D. Virtual IP. Correct answers for each question. Why choose CERT 007 study material for your preparation? Thank you for watching. Subscribe CERT 007 for more info.